for a taste test Tuesday. Say that fast five times. We're going to taste test a couple jams. Or, I guess you would call them both jams. One of them, I had trouble finding it, but I found it in the stores again. It's lemon curd. It's out of Great Britain mainly, I think. This is the brand. I found it at Kroger, I think. Maybe Walmart. That's what it looks like inside. Tastes like um, lemon meringue pie, kind of. And the other one, when my family went to a piece, nearby peach festival, they found this one. So this one may be a little trip trickier to find, although well, it's manufactured in Texans, Texas, but they do have uh, maybe you can a place you can get it. Let's see. It, there we go. It's called Rachel's Texas Twister Jam. And it has peaches, raspberries, mangoes, and jalapenos in it. Sounds yum. This one I haven't had just a little bit. My granddaughter used some over cream cheese. And then you dip it with crackers. Or she used brie. You can do brie or cream cheese. She likes it better with brie. And you just pour any kind of spicy like jalapeno jelly or anything like that over cream cheese or brie. And then you, you know, dip it with crackers. So here is the lemon one. Mmm. Yummy, yummy. I love lemon. This is really good. It's called lemon curd and... A lot of stores have it. You just got to know about it to look for it. And then this is, you can see the jalapeno seeds in it, so it might be spicy. Mm. It doesn't initially taste spicy, but you get some after, afterburn, you know, after you've swallowed it, then you, it gets a little hot. <laughs> So these are both yummy. I like toast once in a while with jam on it or biscuits or even um, waffles. I'll put jam on sometimes. So lemon curd. It's bon maman. Maman. Mama. Maman. Yeah, I think it's maman. Anyway. And that one I think I got at Walmart or Kroger. This one may be a little trickier to find, but if you can find something similar, it's really yummy. It's peaches, raspberries, mangoes, and jalapenos. And it's really good, like if you're having a party, to put something like that over cream cheese or brie or whatever. It's usually a hit down here in Texas anyway, because we like stuff spicy. <laughs> see, I, see, I'll do taste tests with this stuff. I'm not doing taste tests that Tiffany does. Although uh, Tiffany wears t-shirts, although she did do one, she did a live one yesterday, and I didn't think it sounded that bad. It was pickled jalapeno quail eggs. I think they sounded pretty good because I like spicy, I like pickles, I like eggs. What's not to like? So those I probably would have liked okay, but she didn't like them at all. <laughs> I think it was a lot of it. Just, it's the spicy she doesn't like. She doesn't do spicy. And the cons I'm, I'm a texture person too. So I get it if the consistency is kind of. Like I like almost all fish and stuff. But I don't like scallops because of the texture. Because they're chewy. You know. So that's how I am about stuff. Is more like the same with okra. It's slimy. And I mean it tastes okay. But it's the sliminess I can't get past. Ugh. Anyway. Hope you have a great Tuesday, and I have some time this week, hopefully tomorrow, because I'm leaving the next day for my retreat. I should get my um, ice cream box, and we can do that. So Thursday through Saturday, I won't be on hardly at all. I won't be watching your videos. I won't be doing my videos. If I can i'll try and film stuff ahead but i don't really have a whole lot in the in the pipeline to film ahead so i may be mia for a week or half a week anyway thursday through sunday 
and then we'll go back to the the norm next week um on the 26th which is the monday after i come back we're uploading our um snack collab we did we did a summer snacks collab where we all get sent each other summer snacks so there's um, 10 or so of us i think that are doing that so those videos will go up on a week from tomorrow so i hope you all have a great week i won't be around a whole lot this week but hope you have a great week we'll see you soon